world government uses Doflamingo to strike back manga spoiler warning. With the revolutions that are taking place, the rise of Cross Guild, the upset of the Yonkos and the recent actions of Blackbeard. The world government desperately needs new allies to strike back. The Seraphim as far as I know aren't sentient and incapable of planning long convoluted strategies to weed out the pirates and the revolutionaries. What they need is someone sharp, a shepherd for the Seraphim, a suicide bomber that will shake up their enemies. Who better to call on but the agent of chaos, Doflamingo. I'm convinced that if WG negotiates correctly with Doffy, maybe by offering him a position among the celestial dragons or a kingdom of his own, Doffy could become an ally for the WG. WG has a lot of use for Doffy. With his connections with the underworld he could be a very effective spy or a dangerous hitman. A snake in the midst of a mad race to the top. And to me it seems like he's a tier above. The CP0 in terms of power scaling. And not to mention the threat he could pose to the WG's enemies if he's allowed to use a few of the Seraphim. Whatever goal WG may use as him for, it would be a huge mistake not to bring back Doffy to the forefront. As this would be the perfect opportunity to raise chaos, to strike fear into the pirates at sea making them tread slowly, thus giving the WG ample time to round up each of their problems. But I'm not sure how the Joker could react if given a choice like that. All that I've talked about is from the WG's perspective, I'm convinced that Doffy will take the deal if given, but I'm not sure how he'd act once he's out at sea back with his crew. I realize that, when he used to be a warlord he acted on his own accord but how would he act? If the prize is his deepest desire? This is just passing thought, not a completely worked out theory, so I might be completely wrong. Do correct me if so thanks.